Okay, I decided to make a video about my Red Devil Mini. I should have been doing this a long time ago, but I don't think about it. But he's called Mini because he's real mean. My wife will attest to that. He's in a 60 high right now, so that can kind of give you an idea of his size. Hope to get him in like a 200 or a 300 soon. But for now, I keep the water clean and he's content. He's never known anything larger. So as long as I keep my bio in check, he does fine. So basically, what's inspiring me to make this video is yesterday, I switched the rocks around a little bit to better fit him. And as you can see, there's some of my collection of rocks. And this is what I ended up with, okay? Now what I'm wanting to do, I got to put the rocks right on the bottom. Otherwise he basically, as he moves his rocks around, he chisels that out. And it's kind of dangerous. I don't want him to cause an avalanche, hurt himself, break the glass, whatever. <clears throat> well, yesterday was the first time when I was in there that he was just extra super aggressive. Like he always nips at me. He bites me when he gets me. Usually I draw blood. But like this time was different. Because like usually when I draw blood, it's more like when you skin your knee, it's kind of like a spongy blood. Or he bites me and like he leaves perfect teeth marks. Almost like when a kid bites another kid and they leave teeth marks. But he bit me so hard on my pinky finger. Let me try to zoom in on that that it bled pretty good like it bled bled like it was coming out like I had to actually put a paper towel around my finger and then it bled through the paper towel and that was yesterday and even now it's still as I use it keeps reopening and like bleeding out so what I want to do because I redid the rocks I bought a couple of uh, base stones okay and I'm going to put those base stones on the left and right side, move all the rocks, get it right on the under gravel filter. And in the process, normally when I would do something like that, he'd start biting at me. And like, I don't like want to swing at him because I want him to stay mean. I mean, the whole purpose of having a red devil is to have him be mean. You know what I mean? So I don't want to like terrify him, but usually I can kind of like, slowly bump at him or whatever and I get him the back not this time he's just he's hit that age where he's just on a on a tirade you know he's insane now so Instead of being careful and trying to get the rocks out, I'm just going to take them out. And for your YouTube viewer pleasure entertainment, I'm going to let them beat the shit out of me. My wife says it's not a good idea. I think it's a good idea. So, now you know how these things are. They seem to get camera shy. A lot of times they do one thing and then when there's a camera around, they do another or uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe he'll be less violent because my wife's going to be recording when I get my hands in there. And he really likes my wife because she's the primary feeder. I never feed him. I clean his tank only. I wanted my wife to have that relationship with him. Anybody who's had cichlids knows that they know who feeds them. And he really loves my wife. But let me give you a close-up of him. To give you a size reference, there's my hand. He's a good size. So let me go ahead and uh, stop this in. And then when I get up there and start taking rocks out, my wife's going to record. Alrighty, he started getting riled up. I took the tops off and he knows like he does not like when you mess with his rocks like all that gravel was flat yesterday he already started doing his little cichlid moving 
But like when I took those tops off, he was mad. He's like, what are you doing? I wish he'd do his when he yawns. Mean fishy. Okay, I cut away from the tanks for a second. I just wanted to try to get you. Let's see if I could get this in the sunlight. You know, the pictures never do any justice. That fucker got me good, man. We're all set to do it. My wife's like, oh, you better eat first. Okay. <clears throat> the kid's scared that I might get stitches. I don't think it's going to be that bad. I don't even know if he's with all of us looking, if he's going to be as temperamental. But let's see. the one rock fall from the rocks okay so there's that let's get these other ones out see what stinks is I gotta pick up that rock and not drop it ah. Ah. Mm, it's like what you just took my house away stay away from the fingers Ugh. Now he's biting a little softer. He might be getting. Ow! Ow! Oh, never mind. So <laughs> 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 ah! There you go, look, it's already getting me. He does not like when I move his rocks. Ow! Ow, get back, get back. I guess he's back to being docile, huh? Maybe he's like, oh, the damage is done. He tasted your blood. The damage is done. He's already moved my beloved rocks. Ow! Uh, oh, that one hurt. Don't speak too soon. Got me right on the knuckle. <clears throat> Okay, let's put that one right there. 
make sure he's got his little front path there. If we weren't recording, he'd be being a lot more violent right now. Or he just got enough bites on me, he's feeling good. Wish I had a longer arm. Too bad it's got to get a little foggy for moving the rocks. Mm show, huh? If that camera wasn't there, he'd be eating me right now. Well, not as violent as I was hoping for, but it never works that way on camera, does it? Maybe another time we'll get them better. You all done? Yeah. Alrighty. I was hoping that would have been a little more entertaining. It really wasn't that good. But I can kind of show you what happened from that. This one's a funny angle right here. But there's times where it's just worse. But like I said, he had a crowd. We were recording. I'll make another one in the future. I'll tripod it with nobody around but me.